Hi guys, Alicia here. I'm super pumped to show you the sled I have sitting behind me because it has just about every trick part that you're gonna wanna check out for this season for your alpha. Let's take a look. Zebro's A arms with a billet upper and a curved chromoly lower that's both stronger and lighter and offers more clearance than stock. The Zebro's front bumper is sleek, it's strong, it is easy mounting and comes with a skid plate as well. For maximum flotation and increased deep snow agility, this sled has the SLP Powder Pro Ski. This sled is set up with the Kashima coated factory series Fox shocks all the way around with QS3 adjustable compression and QSL adjustable rebound. The Ice Age Elevate spindle set raises the chassis two inches, um, increases agility and maneuverability of the sled, and because it's a billet part, it's also stronger than stock as well. A brake reservoir cover is a no brainer for any sled because it protects an otherwise rather exposed brake reservoir. If any of you have had brake reservoir problems back in the woods, it can be a day ruiner. The brake lever also by TKI is pretty sweet because it decreases the reach for people with small hands like me. We see increased brake control. TKI also developed the rail brace for the Alpha to stiffen the middle section and billet rear wheels to strengthen that area. If you're looking for a lightweight snow flap, the guys at Speedworks have you covered. The Articat Black Hat's running boards are rugged extruded aluminum. They add strength and reduce snow buildup. They've got aggressive grip. And they also maintain good rider position as opposed to some of those round tube ones that can kind of roll your foot up on the edge. One of my favorite parts on this sled is the TKI belt drive. It reduces over nine and a half pounds of weight and two and a half pounds of rotating mass. It requires no modifications to the OEM parts, and although this particular setup is tankless, so no oil reservoir, they also offer a kit with an oil reservoir. The heart of this sled gets a boost from a Speedworks supercharger. At 225 horsepower on pump gas, it's true pull and go riding thanks to the programming from the guys at Speedworks. 